my name is Andrea, I'm business manager at Leaf Space and today I'm gonna walk you through uh, one of the projects that we have recently completed. This is a two-story penthouse with four bedrooms and just under 7,000 square feet. Um, so I'm just gonna show you around some of the key spaces of the house, so just yes, follow me. Here we are in the living and dining area, which is, I think, one of the most important uh, areas in the house. So this is a double height space. So the challenge was really bringing a design. So for that, we created different uh, pieces of wall paneling and wall finishes. So you can see here some examples. So we use some uh, plaster trimming to really divide and create a smaller perception of these long walls and um, also some veneer. In this dining area, we created a focal point behind the dining table that has different elements to it. So it has some painted mirror, some veneer paneling, some spray painted panels as well. So the material palette here, again, is quite neutral, leaning towards greys and some accents of gold and brass. So we are in the master bedroom now. In the whole house, we have used quite a neutral palette, but in this specific room, I think we went a little bit warmer than in other areas. So we have some warm grays and some beiges as well. And in terms of the materials that we used, uh, all the walls, as you can see, they have a vinyl wall covering, which is a slightly higher specification to the traditional wallpaper. And that we also built uh, some carpentry by the TV just to conceal uh, all the cables and, and boxes that come with it. So yeah, this is pretty much everything in the master bedroom. I'm just going to show you now the walk-in wardrobe. Yeah, so we are here in the walk-in wardrobe. So in this area, this used to be um, another bedroom. So we did a fair amount of space planning just to make it, to convert it into a walk-in wardrobe. One of the favorite parts is this display cabinet. Uh, we wanted to give it a boutique feel and really display some of her favorite pieces and her favorite handbags. And we also created some custom drawers for jewelry. So it has really a custom made storage inside for all her pieces of, of jewelry. So here uh, we are in the common bathroom and one of my favorite parts uh, of this area is the onyx wall, which is quite a unique material. So what we did in this case was we created a backlit effect with LED lighting behind. So we are really taking advantage of that translucency of the material that creates this beautiful effect. And in the rest of the areas we used uh, polished Italian tiles. We are really leaning into that really reflective nature of all the materials to bounce the light and make it look more elegant and, and also a bit more bright. So here we are in the junior master bedroom. We really continued with that neutral palette, but giving a little bit more of like darkness to it. So we wanted to create a really hospitality hotel feel. We use the same uh, type of wood finish that carries all across the project. But also we included a bit of like darker materials to give a bit more contrast to it. And here we are uh, in the rooftop area, which is a semi-indoor-outdoor area. You're looking now at my background, at the outdoor area. So here uh, we used three materials that we are trying to connect with the interior palette as well. We used uh, a wooden looking tile that is kind of carrying that walnut finish. And we also used AstroTurf for the finishes, which is a lot easier to maintain that natural brass. And then we also used some granite and some black deck tone that is kind of carrying that black palette that we have inside. This is the outdoor area, but we also have an indoor area um, that you can see here. So here we have the indoor area of this entertainment room where we have a, a bar for like mixing cocktails, we have the wine fridge, and we also have a lounging area here 
that it's it's next to this projector. So this projector basically is very special because it's something that is projected from the inside, but it can be watched from the inside and the outside as well. So I think this is the end uh, of the tour today. Uh, thank you so much for your time. Um, yes, stay to the end of this walkthrough, and just yes, stay tuned for more content uh, of our recent projects. Uh, yeah, thank you so much. Need more interior design inspiration? Subscribe to our channel for new home tours, design ideas and more every week.